What's going on everybody? Gardening with Bart checking back at it again. Today I'm going to give you a quick garden tour, let you see how everything's progressing. Uh, some things are doing better than others. Um, so let's hop in, get right into it. Started off with the peas. Uh, one thing that I kind of messed up on this season, uh, when I planted these, it was still kind of summerish time. <laughs> very hot out in the 90s um, I think I need to either have a little shade cloth for them and or plant them once they're just a little bigger because um, the heat really knocked the heck out of them my green bean plant went ahead and took off it grew so huge after I cut the top and I just did a little harvest of, of green beans off of it. Uh, not a ton, but enough for for a nice a nice snack for dinner. Nice little vegetable. My beets are looking awesome. Let me see if I can get you down in there. So. I'll be harvesting some of these pretty soon. I went ahead and I sowed kale and we've been getting a lot of rain so I think some of it may have washed down because I see a bunch looks like it's starting where the wood chips are. Compost pile still doing well. Come over to the seeds that I direct sowed. I had one about where that tag is that I broke the top off when I planted. There was another one about here that ended up dying. These guys, for whatever reason, they're just kind of chilling. This guy here, he's growing well. My other ones, hopefully the sun's not too crazy, but uh, the leaves are starting to die. But this thing went crazy. in the pine tree. Still got my early girl tomatoes. These two in the front are the seeds that I uh, sowed into the uh, eggshell containers in the very beginning of, of the season. So they're looking very nice. This is another one that was in the eggshell container. This guy here is the big boy. And it still has a couple nice sized fruit on it. It probably got to around, I'd say eight to nine feet tall. Another early girl. The cherry hybrid. I just picked a handful of nice ripe tomatoes off of that. The zucchini, Black Beauty zucchini, that planted, looking good. Basil's looking awesome. This was an earlier zucchini that I planted. Um, what I just took out, uh, summer squash. The the crook neck squash and this was an earlier uh, one that I took out I actually transplanted this squash from it was next to my jalapeno pepper plant it was right here and that was the last black beauty zucchini that I planted Over this way, some radishes are just starting to poke up. I'm actually gonna be clearing out the two rows of carrots. In the center, I planted more carrots, and I planted uh, some more carrots right along here. In here, I have mixed green lettuce. Here are the bush beans that I planted. I have one, two, three, four, 
five that germinated out of the nine plants that I did, my, <laughs> uh, my spinach isn't doing as well. I have, where is he? Just starting to poke out. Um, so luckily I do have some more inside. I'm gonna see if I can get them in the ground soon. Uh, with it being my first year ever getting any, I tried uh, sunflower. I have four total planted. One, two, three, and four. The jalapenos still looking very nice. Green pepper. Over here still have a couple couple little guys on there. This one here is my red bell pepper, so they have not started turning red yet. And lastly, my last green pepper. Yeah, that's the best looking carrot I've pulled so far. Ooh. So check that out. I'm pretty happy with that. Comment, subscribe below. Let me know if you're growing carrots. Let me know what you're growing in your garden. I always like to compare and, and see how everybody else made out. Thanks for stopping by.